Hi guys, a oh, very good evening to all of you. So I was just trying to settle this uh, device and uh, there was some trouble. So for one or two minutes I, uh, I was struggling. Finally, I'm back. You can see my face. There is a lot of sunburn. I was in Ladakh attempting Ladakh set exam. There were so many questions. Normally, uh, I have also given the review of Ladakh set. It was not very tough. It was not also easy. It was moderate. Now in this particular session, I'm going to tell you what should you do in last two months. So this is 6th of October. We have 6th November, 6th December. So approx two months and you have an exam, right? So many of you have this question, how to prepare, what to do, what should be the strategy right now? And all these things that you have to check. I'm going to help you using my experience of multiple net set exams. This time I uh, use one of my uh, knowledge, you don't know, one of my experience things. I wanted to leave examination hall. So I called the invigilator and I said, sir, I want to leave. I'm done with my uh, paper. As usual, the invigilator said, sir, you are not allowed to leave. So I said, please read. This is the line. This is the clause. The clause was that if the candidate wants to leave, he can leave with his admit card, paper, all these things there and then only he can leave. So I said, I'm ready to leave my admit card. I'm ready to leave my papers, but I want to leave. The reason why I wanted to leave, I must tell you why I left my exam. I finished my exam in 40 minutes. I took 20 minutes to darken those points, right? OMR sheet dark karna tha. Ab kya hua? I had to go to Nubra approx 140 kilometer drive in the mountain terrain you know Ladakh right see the sunburn my lips are hurting it's, it's a dry cold place so that was the reason I just wanted to start early so I thought that if I wait till 1 30 then we will leave by 2 or 3 after lunch we will reach to Nubra camping in night and driving in Ladakh in night itself is an experience I did that you know Many people think that he's 10 times net, so he must be in the books only, right? No, my dear friend, see my face. You know, it's a dark face. My lips are hurting. I'm smiling. No, it's so good. It's all puppy. It's all, you know, dried. But that was just wow. And I must tell you, I learn and relate literature. Moon, full moon, and mountains, valleys, road, and no other light you have this motorcycle light or the monsoon or, or the moon that was amazing i got a lot of inspiration and i have to share things with you and we will also talk about the important thing how to prepare in these two months first thing when i was driving bike i was focusing my focus was right there so please remember focus is very important it was dark i had to check the status of the road road was full of concrete road was full of stones so my focus it was right there second point i was scared but i did not give up so even if you are scared remember being scared is not a problem it's not a bad habit you live in society we understand the you know the repercussions of things so we are scared what makes you different is that you don't give up so i was also scared but i did not give up then I didn't let my fear conquer my brain. I did a proper drive. I did not take sharp cuts. I did not try to run or I did not give up. So just like this, we love, uh, we learn from nature. That's I want to share with you. Exam hai, dar lag raha hai, koi baat nahi, dar sab ko lagta hai. Remember there was a military line, military quotations likhe hoi and you know military, it just fills your heart with pride. Bhoat khubsurat line thi military ki. Courage is not absence of fear. Rather, it is a judgment that something is more important than that fear. Courage ka matab ye nahi hai ki aapke andar fear nahi hai. Fear hai. Dar lagna aam baad hai. Lekin courage ek judgment hota hai. Ki kuch bohat jada jaruri hai aapke dar se. Simple example ke saath batata hoon. Phir aap is video ko like kar dena. If you say to a lady or a woman that go and fight with a tiger, a lady will never say that yes, I will fight with the tiger. Right? If you ask a woman to fight a tiger, she will say no. But then what if there is a baby 
her baby is in the mid there is a tiger there is she now tell me she is a mother is she going to say no or she is going to fight to jo aurat us sher se nahi ladna chahti hai us sher ne uske raste mein bachcha hai aur wo sher bachche ke paas ja raha hai wo aurat ladegi it means the courage was always there himmat thi yahan pe jazba tha yahan pe sirf ek wo chahiye tha motivation that i have to fight so you have all these things like this video for this particular message if you have got it right now let's talk about what should you do so uh, first of all those who are facing problems in filling filling the forms don't worry you just fill the forms by midnight maybe uh, by 10 o'clock by 11 o'clock in the evening website will not be that heavy you can fill your forms there now let's talk about two months preparation so first of all if you already have your own time table the old time table please stop using the old time table no and palakshi i don't uh, know this man naruto i was just studying graphic novel so i got to know about this man so i got a t-shirt but i am not a fan of uh, cartoons of naruto i watch tom and jerry mujhe tom and jerry zyada pasand hai ya motu patlu okay now let's get back to the get back to the topic so first of all old time table remove it now the new time table in new time table remember this thing that the last 3 to 4 exams this is what i'm going to tell you it's very important my 10 net experience last 3 to 4 exam they are asking questions from british history last 3 4 exams they are asking questions from british history so if you think that only british history will be asked again you are going to have a blunder in exam you will have make a blunder that's the important point if they are you know how the bowler take wickets bowler will drop you ball out of the wicket line and all of a sudden three balls out of the line and the fourth ball will be a yorker taking your middle stump so if you think that they are asking british history again and again so we will read only british history you will be clean bowled if they surprised you in exam so first of all what should you do make sure you read world literature make sure you read world literature german writers french writers canadians australians russians then italians japanese make sure you remember these writers these writers are mostly not available in market guide books but i must tell you this thing that like you read japanese writers so kazuo ishiguro haruki murakami masho basho these questions are repeatedly asked in fact haiku haikai no renga what is no drama you even john masfield used to write japanese style drama these kind of questions are asked so make sure you remember that do you know in italian writers italo calvino himself then another writer filippo tomaso marinetti they are very important along with these things when you read post colonials so here most of the students make a mistake when they read post colonials they only focus indian post colonial authors this is actually a wrong thing if you focus on only indian post colonial authors you will read kiran desai anita desai arvind adega vikram seth but you must know like you you will read amitav ghosh but make sure you also know that there are multiple writers of post colonial genre and they come from south asian diaspora normally students don't study diaspora nihal de silva himani gunratne these kind of questions have been asked mohsin hamid hanif qureshi alamgir hashmi these kind of you know writers they have been asked in exam akhil sharma sanjeev sahota uh, nadifa mohammad these kind of writers have been repeatedly asked so make sure you go for the diasporic writers south asian diasporic writers which is also called southern post colonial i have a book of a professor in uh, uh, d uday kumar sir from delhi university now in jnu i have his book southern post colonial there i got to know about these things second thing that you have to remember when you go for post colonial make sure you go for post colonial theories you should know the difference between colonials neo colonials and post colonials you will have 6 to 7 questions from post colonials Salman Rushdie vs Naipaul most important then if you go for african and afro american literature so i must tell you this point this is again very important africans afro american writers are the part of post colonials but they are also the part of aboriginal literature they are also the part of minority literature they are also the part of literature in translation or 
they can be separately studied as the native literature so make sure when you read african writers separately afro americans separately tanisha has written that abhi culture studies nahi hua hai tanisha exam 2 mahine ke baad hai culture study 2 mahine pehle thodi hoga time ke sath hoga aisa you know you when you go to the class with the very first day i give you everything you will end up missing all these points so remember what i'm telling you note it down along with these things when you go for literary theory normally people are studying formalism structuralism new criticism deconstruction new historicism but then in ladakh set also there was a question chronological order of these theories and also go for phenomenological reduction empiricism hermeneutics the idea of dialogism the idea of carnivalesque then there are multiple theories which are actually related to post colonials stranger king theory call and response theory then uh, speech act theories these kind of theories are there make sure you remember this now what you have to do two months left no need to go for textual readings if you are reading the text normally if you are in my class i don't recommend text because the time is less there are hundreds of books you can't read everything but many you are going for selective reading touch the fields like gender study if i ask you how many of you remember gender study in ladakh said also there was a proper question about judith butler ivakovsky so if you don't know about gender studies if you don't know about lgbtq studies what is the idea what do you mean by gender trouble what is the meaning of the line a woman is not born but becomes you will have a lot of issues then second thing another thing the next thing we have is they go for indian aesthetics most of the students they don't read indian aesthetics they don't know what is natya shastra how many rasas are there how many these rasas have been studied from the dhoni point of view who is anand vardhan who has written abhinav bharti who is abhinav gupta or along with these things there are many writers from uh, kashmiris kalhan is there raj uh, raj tarangi that has been written by then we have raj shekhar and along with that we have kuntak acharya kuntak so make sure you go for a separate reading of indian aesthetics now comes dalit literature most of the students miss dalit literature they make a mistake dalit literature padh ke nahi jaate and the reason is that dalit literature is not mentioned in the syllabus so why should we read in fact a lot of coaching people they don't teach dalit literature they say that it is not in the syllabus it is in the syllabus it is also the part of indian literature it is also the part of the new literatures along with that it is also the part of subcultures so when you go for culture studies it is also the part of subcultures so when you read dalit literature make sure om prakash valmiki juthan you know sharmila rees writing caste writing gender durga bai vyams bhimaina make sure you remember that thing then daya pawar baluta is very important meena kand swami uh, my lover speaks of rape that's very very important torch touch poetry these are very very important you know om prakash valmiki is actually the godfather of dalit literature daya pawar anna bhau sathe you should know what is dalit panther movement what is ds4 movement then how the first dalit conference took place what was the idea of the first dalit conference what was the first dalit book written by or who are the first ancient writers writing dalit literature uh, if you have watched my videos on youtube these are available you don't have to go for the class it is available free of course watch my videos on dalit literature those who didn't know that that you have to read these things please like the video till then my lips are hurting because it's they are all dried up in ladakh i take some hot water it's paining actually you know it's a dry air and a very cold temperature okay now getting back uh, 240 students are live and only 117 likes come on guys let's go for the more likes now we have recent nobel awardees booker awardees pulitzer awardees sahitya academy awardees and along with that you have to go for gyan peet awards write down this thing if you want to crack jrf if you want to have double jrf like me write down these points booker awards very very important and again students make a mistake they don't know about indian booker awards have you ever uh, thought like this that we indians have also won booker awards so we should know so make sure you remember arundhati roy god of small things there are so many questions asked in exam from god of small things 
the story is set in kerala mm then who is velutha who is rahel istapan uh, istapan and uh, amma baby kochamma these characters have been repeatedly asked then kiran desai inheritance of loss who is bizu who is sai the famous character jemu bhai patel these are very important then arvind adiga the white tiger 2008 booker award who is balram halwai it was also the question of madhya pradesh set exam then what's the name of the village lakshman gard what do you mean by the white tiger once you are done with these things my dear students please do not miss indian pulitzer awards the pulitzer awards are given to americans then why did i say indians there are many indians who are living in america have american citizenship and they have won pulitzer award to aapko unka bhi dhyan rakhna padega ki kaun kaun se indians ko pulitzer award mila hai just think about it you want to have a jrf think about it how many indians have won pulitzer award think about it and let me know till then i have i'll have some hot water the most famous we have is jhumpa laidi <laughs> for interpreter of melodies yes just like this go for pulitzer awards then go for commonwealth writers award amit choudhary a new world commonwealth writers award there is a kashmir conspiracy mr ak raza he has won that then and there is vikram uh, his name is uh, film is vikram a vikram he has also won the commonwealth writers award along with these things please 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 remember sahitya academy award winners do you know the first sahitya academy award winner rk narayan the guide then raja rao then there are so many people there was a question in net exam that who has won sahitya academy award for the famous work the sari shop rupa bajwa so you have to remember this thing then india after gandhi ram uh, uh, mr guha ram sharan guha ram sharan guha miss this name sorry <coughs> just like this there are so many other sahitya academy award winners those errors are correct by jit thail that's a sahitya academy award so make sure you remember that indian sahitya academy awards then booker awards and then comes nobel do you know the first nobel 1901 suri pradhom the first britisher to win nobel award rudyard kipling first indian to win nobel award rabindranath tagore gitanjali very important post office very important uh child the child it's very important so make sure you know these people they are very very important then ts elliot himself was a nobel award in 1948 so there are so many nobel award is samuel beckett is a nobel award e jean paul sartre is a nobel award e uh, derek walcott is a nobel award e seamus heaney is a nobel award e there are so many questions so inko bhi padhna hai if you actually want to get jrf you must be thinking na who are the people who get jrf jrf is not that easy now a lot of people qualified net but if you want to go for, go for jrf remember you will have to be best out of the best exceptional hona padega dusro se alag hona padega then go for some new literatures random literatures in trauma studies the concept comes holocaust literature holocaust h o l o c a u s t holocaust literature those who didn't know it like it because this is going to increase the knowledge जिन बच्चों को होलोकास्ट लिटरेचर के बारे में नहीं पता है और आपको लग रहा है कि काश हमें इस लेवल पे कोई पढ़ा था लाइक द वीडियो कम ऑन आई टेल यू अबाउट होलोकास्ट लिटरेचर सो वी नो अबाउट द ज्यूज हिटलर द इश्यू हवाय हिटलर वॉज किलिंग द ज्यूज राइट इट इज सेट सिक्स मिलियन ज्यूज वर स्लॉटर्ड वर किल्ड बाय हिटलर बट इट वॉज नॉट अ डायरेक्ट किलिंग नो properly arranged killings villages were set up cities were set up towns were set up bakayda village cities towns bana ke rakha jata tha they were made to live in the refugee camps camps banaye gaye the and there they were killed how sometimes they were testing medicines sometimes they were testing chemicals and can you imagine this thing that the description of holocaust horror which is also called the concentration camp horror it's just unbelievable you know what will they do they will make some chemical they will call you they will make you drink it and you drink the chemical and they will see the result on your skin how you are dying they will note down these things those gas capsules they will have 20 30 people locked in a room they will throw a gas capsule and they will say that one capsule can kill 20 people 30 people for their time pass for the pleasure time they would tie people 
the, they would have people, uh, their eyes were locked, eyes were tied, and they would make the people run in the ground, which is which was having landmines. They were playing. They used to play, and they would make people run in the grounds, checking their the uh, landmines. They would tar do the target practice on the living human beings. Imagine this thing. Is they say Holocaust trauma. This is Holocaust literature. Those who did not know it, please like this video because this is knowledge. You like is a clap for me. Aapka ek like mere liye choti si tarif hai. Now, Holocaust literature. When I came to Delhi University, there I uh, got the idea about this thing. People were talking about this thing. So we talk about N. F. Frank is there. Thomas Neely he has written. Uh, William Styron he has written. There are questions from Holocaust poetries. Holocaust people, they survived. Some of them ran away. Some of them were uh, rescued. So they have talked about the horrors of those conditions. They did not know next day they will die or not. And they, they used to pray to have a peaceful death. They used to pray for that thing. So that's what you have to remember that, you know, you have Holocaust literature. Hai. Next literature that you have to remember and read is graphic novels. You know, graphic novels... Okay, Shweta has told us, Shweta is from, uh, Shweta has been to Poland and Shweta still, uh, has told me that she was in Poland and she has seen these kind of places. Yes, even uh, it, London is in my list. So whenever I go to London, there is a chamber of horror and I have to see that. I will also see. So now, you know, uh, talking about graphic novels. So those who don't know about graphic novels, please write down because you can also use this thing in your PhDs, PhD topic, a recent topic. Graphic novels may you just have to remember first of all what is a simple novel? What is a graphic novel? Now tell me this thing which is better a movie or a book? You know, I have uh, not read Great Gatsby. I have watched a movie So the in movie Great Gatsby Leonardo DiCaprio was playing the role of Mr. Gatsby The role of Nick Carraway was played by uh, Toby Maguire what we call the spider-man thing So you tell me which is better movie or the book? Movie, 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 okay, movie, movie. Which is better, movie or the book? Till now we are getting options of movie only. Movie, movie. Ek ne bola hai book, dusre ne bola hai book, teen char book, book, okay. <laughs> you know, the same question was asked in Delhi University interview. What is the difference between movie and a book? You have written Great Gatsby, right? F. Scott Fitzgerald wrote Great Gatsby. Story of a lover boy. It got converted into a movie. Of amazing movie, no doubt. It was a br brilliant movie. Which one is better? So you somebody says movie, somebody says book. But can you just tell me if book is better, why book is better? And if movie is better, why movie is better? Okay, I'll give you the answer for all the people who are hungry for knowledge, thirsty for knowledge. Movie is not that good. Note it down. It is the book which is much better than movie. It is the book which is much better than movie. Some of you have written that book is carrying the actual essence. No, 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 no. Somebody says book is authentic. No, 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 no. Not because book is authentic, movie is a copy. No, 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 no. Okay, now, and uh, I will also say that. Just, how many of you have seen Great Gatsby? How many of you have watched The Great Gatsby? Kitne logo ne Great Gatsby dekha hai? Movie dekhi Great Gatsby. I have watched it. I have watched it. I loved it. Komal has watched it. Samreen has watched it. Prerna Joshi has watched it. Bahut badia. Komal hai. Swarna hai. Okay. Now I have a question. Now I have a question from those who have watched it. Baki log dhyan lagana. Baki log dhyan se suna. Rest of you just try to understand. Those who have watched Great Gatsby, please tell me. What was the face appearance of Great Gatsby? Great Gatsby kaisa dikhta tha? Come on, those who have watched it, tell me. 
ग्रेट गेट्स बी कैसा दिखता था वट वॉज द फेस काउंटेनेंस अपियरेंस ऑफ ग्रेट गेट्स बी यू विल से सर लियोनार्डो डी कैप्रियो सर दैट हैंडसम हीरो लियोनार्डो डी कैप्रियो राइट दैट्स वॉट मूवी किल्स दैट्स वॉट मूवी किल्स This is Delhi University standard. समझ में आ रहा होगा I'm sure. I'm trying to make it easy for you. The movie kills your independent imagination. The visual presentation, visual representation kills your independent imagination. Write down this point. Note this point. The movie presentation, the visual presentation actually kills your imagination. Actually kills your imagination. did you understand because if you have not watched movie you are reading a book great gatsby a charming personality a dashing man a rich woman a rich man you will have your imagination your imaginary face your kind of hero but then when they say no 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 this is leonardo di caprio your independent imagination got blocked so technically what gives you more pleasure your imagination or the reality or the re visual presentation imagination imagination is in your you know it takes you to the extreme heights where you want to have that feel that's imagination visualization of the characters destroys the independent identity remember this point haryana ke hpsc mein media theory ka part hai ye this is the part of media theory did you understand Did you understand? जिनको समझ में आ गया है वीडियो लाइक करो जिनको समझ में आया आई विल टेक प्रॉपर लेक्चर्स ऑन ग्राफिक नॉवल द प्रोज एंड कॉन्स एंड द फेमस ग्राफिक नॉवल राइटर्स श्वेता तनेजा कल्ट ऑफ केस आई विल टॉक अबाउट ऑल दीज थिंग्स इवन डिकिनसियन नॉवेल्स हैव बिन री इंट्रोड्यूस इन ग्राफिक नॉवल स्टाइल सो सी वॉट हैपन्स लेट्स मेक इट मोर इजी लेट्स मेक इट मोर इजी इफ यू वी हैव वी ऑल आर इंडियंस वी हैव वॉश शक्तिमान राइट we are the lovers of shaktiman if you right can you imagine anybody else in the dress of shaktiman except mukesh khanna no you know why because now in our imagination we have been given a face now we have seen him from our childhood we cannot imagine anyone else but what if you are just reading have you seen the face of king arthur you are just reading about king arthur so it can be anyone you will have your king arthur i will have my image of king arthur have we seen helen no we have not seen helen but if you say sir the, the movie troy troy has the girl helen so this is my individual uh, individual uh, point of view i did not find that woman the most beautiful woman of the world when there was a girl playing the role of helen in troy movie so when they say helen was the most beautiful woman of the world was this the face that launched thousands of ships and burned the top stars of elium sweet helen make me model with thy kiss all his ways which is not helena no 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 that girl was not to that level so when i read about helen my helen was somebody different something unimaginable but somebody but the moment you brought a face it killed you independent imagination that's what you have to understand and study in graphic novels those who are targeting net jrf only jrf unko samajh mein aayega ye agar see rest of you if you think that why are why is he talking about all these things why is not talking about hardy dickens basic things my dear friends we are talking about jrf graphic novels what if they just ask you a simple question in assertion and reason assertion is graphic novel is the new kind of literature new trend in literature and a lot of readership is inclined towards graphic novel the reason what will be the reason why graphic novels are more important more famous now why there is a study about graphic novels and now let's switch to cyborg literature jitne students ne cyborg literature ke bare mein kuch nahi suna hai imagine this thing we are living in the world of post humanism human human connections what happens in test of the arbor wilds Tess, she has been raped by Alec. She writes a letter to Angel Clare to inform about the past incident, but then that letter gets ignored. It's like you know, slips under the carpet, and the letter never reaches to the man. 
टेस्ट ने एक पत्र लिखा अपने हस्बैंड को बताने के लिए एंजल क्लियर को होने वाले हस्बैंड को बताने के लिए दैट सी दिस इज माय पास्ट थिंग आई हैव बीन रेड आई एम नो मोर अ वर्जिन सो आई वांट टू टेल इट टू यू बट द लेटर गॉट स्लिप्ड अंडर द कारपेट एक कारपेट के नीचे चला गया व्हाट विल बी द ह्यूमन इंटरेक्शन व्हेन इंस्टेड ऑफ लेटर यू हैव अ व्हाट्सएप टेक्स्ट एंड यू आल्सो नो दैट द टेक्स्ट हैज टू ब्लू लाइंस इमेजिन टेस हैड अ मोबाइल फोन अ व्हाट्सएप मोबाइल फोन she would have dropped a whatsapp text she must have checked it that okay there are two blue ticks the message has been received so now human humanity human surrounding anthropological understanding in connection with devices this is what we are going to study in cyborg literature latest literature hai filhal jnu mein study shuru ho gayi hai jnu mein phd start ho gayi hai two of my students are doing phd in jnu they are dealing with cyborg literature now see what is this we are in connection with each other i am talking to you using a device a gadget this itself is the part of cyborg literature it itself is a part we are connected without being connected i can i can't see you i can read your comments you can see me right you can see some of you were asking about the t-shirt right but can i touch you like this hello hand handshake do i know that you are there yes can i see you no do i uh, do i have a social context here yes am i behaving like a teacher yes but do i have my students in front of me no do i feel the presence of the students yes this is cyborg literature human interaction with the mingling of the mixing of the gadgets devices smileys isn't it the worst thing that we have to choose smileys to convey our emotions soon aapka blush kharab ho gaya why because somebody has written a bad joke you want to ignore that person so what do you do ha 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 select 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 and ha 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 okay what is that that cyborg literature now let's take it in a proper way tell me this there is a there is a new development that we human are losing our hair we are actually evolving it is said that soon our hair our ears it will all get you know it will all disappear we are moving towards a newness kind of uh, evolution right so there is a new ev- evolution we are more inclined towards the gadgets now just think about this thing normally be honest be very honest be brutally honest do you have your mobile phones in planes in trains in buses and then when you have your mobile phone and proper internet connection with a good ear plug do you love to feel of uh, to prefer isolation or you still want to talk to people batao mobile ho internet bahut acha ho headphone chal raha ho do we really want to talk to people or we just want to be isolated batao you will have more advanced lectures this time साइबॉग लिटरेचर पे सत्रह अठारह लेक्चर्स रिकॉर्ड कर चुका हूं ऑलरेडी मैं सो वन ऑफ यू सेज दैट आई वुड प्रेफर टू टॉक टू पीपल बट वी मोस्ट ऑफ अस विल गो फॉर आइसोलेशन राइट खाना भी खा रहे ना आई ऑल्सो हैव अ बैड हैबिट आई डोंट माइंड आई आई कैन कन्फेस दिस इन फ्रंट ऑफ माई स्टूडेंट आई हैव अ बैड हैबिट आई कांट ईट विदाउट वॉचिंग टीवी और हैविंग अ फोन इन माई हैंड I know it's a bad habit, but I am addicted to this thing. It's a bad habit. Initially, when I was calling, preparing for JRF, I used to eat. I used to read summaries in mobile phone. Now I have formed a habit. Now I have formed a habit. What is my interaction with people around me? Having dinner? No. Um, if like sometimes I talk, sometimes I don't talk. If I'm in a bus, I'm in a plane. I also prefer headphones and don't want to talk. What are we moving towards? the social structure the anthropological structure gets formed when there is an interaction of discourse but now everybody has individualization everybody has minds uh, headphones personal internet personal chats secret conversations and everybody has his own imaginary world which is not a world which is not even a world that's called simulacra simulation in cyborg literature soon we are going to replace human do you know that the humans will be replaced Yes, my face has high ice burns. My lips are paining. I was in Ladakh. I did approx four hundred, five hundred kilometer bike ride, Pangong, 
then uh, Nubra, Hunder, Sangla Valley, Chusul, Razangla. That was amazing. I'll share the story. Now, now I'm back and I'm back to my work with double energy, double efforts. So that's what you have to read. Make sure, see, if you want to get JRF and you are reading the same thing that everybody is reading, then you will never get JRF. Trust me. If everyone thinks that Anglo-Section to T.S. Eliot we have read or okay or the modern writers we have read so I am going to get JRF. No, my dear friend, no, not at all. That's the reason JRFs are very much counted. Many of the experts who are studying JRF are not their JRF. Everybody is good in British history. Being good in British history is a basic thing. In all top Indian universities, they all are damn good in British history. But what lies behind, you know, ahead of British history? The next step, the new literatures. Just ask yourself how many of you know what is subcultures? Tell me, how many of you know what is subculture? There is an idea of multiculturalism. Subcultures, kya hota hai? Multiculturalism, kya hota hai? There is a cute question that mama ni daarti aapko. Daarti hai mama. My mama says that keep your phones away. <laughs> but I don't live with, with my parents. My parents are back home in the village living a better life. In the village there is a better life. In Delhi we are all robots. We are running. We are running with no direction, no particular target. We are just running. So I do feel the cyborg idea. I'll share it with you. Now, please remember the other literature that you have to go for is eco-criticism and eco-feminism. 99% students do not read it. Some of them, they don't even know it. Not your fault. Your teachers don't teach. It's not in your university. But your eco-criticism, eco-feminism is equally very, very important. Along with these things, go for the writers in translation. Vinita, Goa set nahi hota, but I Goa aata rehta hon. When the literature is a lot of headache, I come to Goa. So don't worry. Goa, I'll come to Goa surprisingly. Last time also I had a meeting with some of my students. Goa set doesn't happen. Goa set will happen, I'll definitely be there. But see, remember this point. What you have to study translation writings, that is very important. In Prem Chand's selected works in translation, in Ravina Tagore's selected works in translation, in Aurobindo's famous works in translation, and along with that, please remember, Lihaf. Ismat Chuktai Lihaf. It's very important in translation. Make sure you read those things. ये सारी चीजें translation writers में आएंगी list बना लो one more thing that you have to do that's what you have to do in British history from Anglo section to Chaucer then Dark Age then Elizabethan then all these people major writers all the birth dates major writers all the birth dates all important publication they'll simply say religio medici by Thomas Brown was published in it's a repeated question they'll simply say anatomy of melancholy by Robert Burton published in repeated question the Battle of Glorious Revolution, 1688, repeated question. First folio collection of Shakespearean works, Shakespearean plays, it's a repeated question. The collection of Shakespearean sonnets by Thomas Thorpe, 1609, repeated question. Publication of Ben Johnson's, uh, sorry, uh, Francis Bacon's final 58 essays, repeated question. So make sure your chronology is really good. Your chronology, your in-depth knowledge will save you in assertion reason questions and match the followings along with that make sure when you read the ages just not read the writers as writers if you're reading writers only as writers only but you don't know the difference between the restoration and augustine if you don't know the difference between restoration and augustines you will look left and right in your exam paper how many of you know the difference between augustines and pre-romantics and similarities between you can watch it again all those who have missed my narration see I, ha I have a lot to speak you know having all my knowledge of these things and I keep reading I am working on ecofeminism now I'll share my knowledge with you graphic literature cyborg literature I sh I'll share my, my knowledge with you we are also going to talk about diaspora and southern diaspora Southern diaspora is more important. Normally people would read Indian diaspora. Everybody would read Indian diaspora. But what is different in you? You must know the Southern diaspora, at least the Asian diaspora. There are so many writers. The Bangladeshi writer Monica Ali, she has been asked an exam. 
Ladakh said, paper, I will provide you complete solution. There are so many easy questions, just like from rapid fire. So I'm also going to deal with Ladakh said tomorrow in my offline batch. I'll share it with them also. And I'll bring the proper solution for all of you. Ladakh said, MPZ, last all these set exams. See, uh, now I'm done with my Ladakh set. Now month of October, November and the exam till December. This is my individual target. This is my target to provide more learnings, more knowledge in last four units. So it's my own target because I also have to read new things. I also have to connect multiple random questions asked. Abhi mera apna target hai. All the online students who are in the batch, ye mera apna target hai. This is my own target to provide you 200 times, 300 times more knowledge. So jo bhi cheez hum pehle padate the, uska dugna tigna ho jaye. This is for me also. I also have to read a lot thing, you know, because there are so many random questions asked. So I have to arrange that new syllabus which has been asked. They are shifting the syllabus. You know, sometimes they announce that there is a change. Sometimes they don't announce. They just ask new questions. So there is actually a change and December exam, they will surprise you. December exam, you will surprise karenge. Just like they surprised everybody in Rajasthan set exam. So we are going to solve all those Rajasthan set questions and we'll be prepared for the worst. My simple funda is prepare for the worst. Apne aapko toughest paper ke liye karo. Toughest ke liye. Don't go to exam with prayers that okay sir please give me easy paper. No, I don't want easy paper. I will be ready for the worst. Toughest ki tayari karenge, toughest paper dene jayenge. Kar denge yaar. I come from a village right? I come from a village. You see my uh, pet dog tiger? Tiger is here. He's resting under. I'm taking my class and resting here. So you can do it. I came from the village. I am 10 times net. 10 times. First net, my father used to ask me, read, prepare, net ke padho, net ke padho. I used to ask my father, Papa, kabhi net qualified dekha hai Rajasthan mein? Kabhi aapne English mein? Have you ever seen anybody qualifying net in English? My father would keep mom. That was my defense. Whenever my father would say, Padho, mehnat karo, net karo, qualify net. I will say, have you ever seen anybody qualifying English net? If you have not seen anybody qualifying English net, why are you asking me? Coming from a small town, from a government school background, I am a Vivekanandu, I am a top kar dena hai. Now, fa my father, sometimes when he is very happy, when he is very, uh, you know, proud, he says, come, ask me again. Ask me, have you ever seen anybody qualifying net? Then I, I then I then I'll smile, Papa. Dekha kabi kisi net qualify. Then he will say, My son, double JRF, ten net, Delhi University assistant professor. So even I didn't know that things will happen. But this happened. Now this is my duty. I must tell you there are so many random things. Itni red. Have you ever uh, uh, you know studied about this thing? What is hypertext? Textuality of the text and the hypertext. If you don't know these things, they are going to ask these things. Net is national eligibility test. High level exam hai. So questions are there. So in hundred questions, you are not able to understand what they are asking. How are you going to go, go and get a net in JRF? It's tough, but it's not impossible. It is tough, but it's not impossible. And that's why English net has a value. English net ki value bhi wa se hai. Abhi bhi achhe salary mil jayegi. And those who are asking a tiger, can tiger? Aja. Chal. He's lying, rest kar rahe. I'll show you when I'll uh, end my session. So this is message to all of you. Please make a new timetable, focus on all the new topics that I have told. And yes, the fresh batch is starting from 10th October. Thus October say fresh batch. Hai. I could not reply many of your uh, queries because I was in Ladakh. I'm back. All the students who have liked this, please uh, video ko like karna, achha lage to. And those who want to join the batch, this is, <laughs> yes, those who want to join the online classes or the batch, 10th October, the fresh batch is going to start. So you can join the batch, you will be the part of this thing. And uh, for private video live session, we are going to start mentorship program. So all the, uh, all the online students who are registered for private live video session, the mentorship program will be uh, launched for you. We are going to talk face to face, we are going to help individual students. So I'll talk one by one, baat ke nahi karunga, that will be a mentorship program. So see you all. Thank you so much. And as I'm going to end my session, I'll show you my pet dog. Tiger. This is my tiger. 
so he is not in good health and uh, he is resting so i hope uh, he'll be fine soon tiger see is resting down anyway guys chalo will uh, will be uh, meeting again soon stay tuned subscribe the channel and those who want to join the batch whatsapp me 8810289637 Double eight one zero two eight nine six three seven. I am reading some of the cute comments. Mirror liye sare lips pad gaye. See the burn, ice burn. But you know what is most important? Khar Dungla, the second highest motorable road, third time. So I did that. I'll share my photos. If you want to follow me on Instagram, my Instagram is Professor Vinith Pandey. So that's my personal Instagram. Two months, बहुत है energy आ रखी है. बहुत है दो महीने. कौन कहता है आसमां में छेद नहीं हो सकता एक पत्थर तो तबे से उछालो यारो कोशिश तो करो चलो गॉड ब्लेस यू गुड नाइट टेक केयर एंड यस रिपीटिंग माय नंबर अगेन डबल एट वन जीरो टू एट नाइन सिक्स थ्री सेवन गॉड ब्लेस यू